Tri-Staters are preparing to take a walk, run, roll, or motorcycle ride to honor disabled American veterans. And joining us to talk about next weekend's DAV 5K is National Race Director Laura Rushi. Thanks for coming in, Laura. Yeah, thank you. Yeah, thank so me. talk about this race. It's so important. I think that we're doing a lot better job in this country these days of honoring our veterans. Uh, this is just a continued uh, uh, focus on that. Yeah, you know, DAV, Disabled American Veterans, was founded in Cincinnati in 1920. Wow. Um, so we've been in this community for a very long time. After the First yeah. World War. Yes, yes, nearly 100 years. Um, and this is our second annual DAV 5K. So this is a way that we are able to bring our local community together to really show thanks and honor and then to help us fundraise so that we can do more good things for veterans mm -hmm. in Cincinnati and across the country. Yeah, well, everybody can talk the talk rather easily, but you guys are walking the walk. What do you do to support these disabled veterans? Yeah, so DAV has many service programs that we offer to veterans completely free of charge. Um, the primary way that we do serve veterans um, is through their help with VA medical benefits. Um, so when veterans transition... You help them with the paperwork? Yeah, help them with the paperwork and just help them understand what they're um, eligible to receive. It's a very confusing process. It can mm -hmm. be pretty complicated I can to only imagine how pleased they are with that assistance. We're looking at a little video from uh, one of the previous year's runs. What are we going to see that's interesting and different at this year's? Yeah, so the, one of the things that was so great about the 5K last year is we had 200 motorcycle riders actually lead the runner start. That sounds um, and neat. So it was a pretty amazing thing. And that actually at the end of the race, they line up the finish. Um, and we're cheering everybody on um, to kind of go across the finish line. So we'll, we're hoping to have that strong support this year. Um, and then we also have um, a way for people to honor the, their loved ones who serve. We do honor bibs. So you can write in the name of the person um, who you're there to, to walk and support or to run and participate in the race. You know, it's always occurred to me that it's just a, a tough road to hoe when you go to defend your country and you, you are disabled and you have to live the rest of your life that way. You know, but I know that a lot of these people that are involved in this situation have incredible spirits and have incredible outlooks. What do you experience in, in speaking with them and being around them. Yeah, you know, and last year, just through the DAV 5K lens, we had a, a woman who was walking in support of her husband that she lost um, just the previous May before wow. he was killed in action. Um, and we had a Vietnam veteran who actually walked the course of the race, and he had not been able to walk um, much, much that, that year really? until he walked with his son. Um, and then we had a family that came together for um, their recent um, war veteran um, who was suffering through PS. PTSD. Mm -hmm. um, so there's many, many ways that veterans kind of have to deal with things after their service time. But the 5K really allows them all to come together, um, support each other, and then really have that pride and thanks um, and being able to do something together and, and show that, that pride. And it tugs at your heart both what they're going through and also what's happening in their honor and right. their support. Thank you for coming and talking to us about Thank it. Thank you. The DAV, you bet, the DAV 5K will be Saturday, November 8th at 20, uh, 2014 at Sawyer Point. The race is going to take off 8.30 a.m. Now, online registration ends today at midnight, so you got to do it. Today, we've posted the link in the On TV section at WLWT.com, then click on the As Seen On tab. And if you think that you might do this, why don't you go to the computer and register right now. You, it'll be something off your plate for the rest of this Sunday.